for Shamela Amber for her project. Thank you. Can I turn on my camera? Yes, of course. It's disabled. Um, let me have a look. Okay, there you go. Okay, thank you. Hello, wonderful people. I'm Shumala Imber. Today, I'm going to show you my scratch project. Its name is Magical Mind Reader. So let's begin. Maha Auntie, can you please choose a number between 1 to 63? That would be 63 to 63, okay. Okay. Is a number in this list? Yes. Is it in this one? 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 Yes. What about in this one? Yes. Yes. Wow. So how, how you read my mind? Can can we do again with the uh, uh, Mama Uzma? Yes, okay. Think of a number. Just think, Uzma, don't tell her. Okay, no need to tell it. Just think it in the mind. Is your number in this list? Your mic is off, Uzma. No. Is it in this one? Yes. What about in this one? Yes. What about in this one? No. Is it in this one? Yes. Is it in this one? No. Bravo. <laughs> now, let me now let me tell you how, uh, how it works. My project uses complicated math to read your mind or the number you're thinking of. I had this idea for making this project because my reading is really cool in my opinion. It's really awesome. In conclusion, my project's name is Magical Mind Reader, which reads people's minds and the number what they think of. I'm a self-taught from YouTube, but especially I would like to thank my trainer, Abu Bakr Sayyid, for showing me how to present my project during the show. And I would also like to thank the creators of the techno show for giving us all the opportunity for showcasing our talent. Thank you. What a little wonder you are. I mean, that image you have used depicts you. I mean, you look just as cute as the little doll. Um, and and I and I like this, you know, bringing in psychic powers into mind reading and calling it mind reading uh love that deduction you know on how you actually um not just read our minds of course there's just more to it than that but you know i i love the way you brought in the element of surprise into it how you allowed people and and you actually held on to my attention i knew where you were going but for a little kid your age to actually do this project in itself is amazing at this age. Thank you. Know? you. Good job. I'm in such a, such a different, uh, on such a different level, on such a different level. And I can actually see you. Um, I, I wouldn't be surprised if you're a creator of future uh, games like, uh, I think it's called uh, Sudoku or something like that, those Japanese yes. numbers. 
I yes. wouldn't be surprised, girl, that, you know, if you are going to play with people's minds in the future. I wouldn't be surprised. I would like to see you go higher up and I would like to see you challenge people's IQs. Okay, inshallah. Yeah. Inshallah, great potential there. Thank you. Well done, Shumaila. I am really impressed again from you and I really like Thank the project uh, because you, you, how you actually use so many codes, so many things in one project and how you assemble every part of it. I, I know what the logic behind this game, but I actually admire at the age of yours. It's uh, remarkable. Good job, Anshumayla. I'm really impressed. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. The moment uh, the MC uh, introduced the uh, project name, um, I got curious. I was like, what is it about? I mean, a child? Uh, presenting a game or a project on this topic. I mean, I was really curious. And when I saw the game, I am totally impressed. Really, really, I'm impressed. And I wanted to play it too. Uh, uh, Maha and Mrs. Uzma, they got the opportunity to play it, but I couldn't. Um, it, it, but it, it's really very impressive. And the way you said that it was self-taught from the YouTube, that, that thing uh, inspired me as well. It was yeah. your... Uh, yeah, it was your determination, your dedication that uh, made you uh, search and learn and then code it accordingly. Uh, it's, it's a wonderful job done. Excellent. Very well done, Shumaila. Shumaila, really do play with uh, Ma'am also. Play the game with Ma'am <laughs> Yeah, I, I would like to play it too. Thank you very much. So can I play with you, Shumaila, your game? Yes, after I upload it on Play Store. Oh, all right. So I download <laughs> it from there, purchase it, and then play it. All let, right. Let Ma'am Gurda play yes. right now. Very Shumayla. well done. Let her play now. Okay. It's all right, Ms. Ma. We, we be short of time. Well, I, I no, playing it is actually giving you an idea of her intelligence. You know, play it because you can see how she's actually filtering it out and getting to that number. It will give you an idea. Please play it so you can have an idea. Shumaila, let her play. Okay. Okay, let's begin. Choose a number, but don't tell it out loud. All right, and I, I love the way uh, this, uh, you've chosen this character with big eyes so that it is very relatable with the statement that you've given, look into my eyes. So, you know, the big eyes, they, it, it's, it's a good idea. It's I made that character. I yeah, it's, character. it's a thoughtful idea that you've chosen a character with big eyes because you can relate it to this. All right, I thought, looks like her. <laughs> okay. I thought of the number. Okay, between one to 63. Oh uh, yeah, I did. Okay. Is your number in this list? No. Is it in this list? No. What about in this list? No. Is it in this list? No. Is it in this list? Yes. Is it in this list? No. Oh my God, seriously, yes, it was 16th, my date of birth. <laughs> Very well done, excellent. Thank you. And it, it appeared only in one list. Yeah, you're right about the filtration part. Very well done. Thank you. What a wonderful project, Shamila. Uh, now let's move on to the next participant. Participant number 23, Zan Abdulaziz, with a project called Labilio, quoting, there's always an easier solution to a difficult problem. Indeed. I repeat, project name Labilio Zan Abdul.